of pet colonization and abandoning Earth, abandoning Earth, and all. And we shouldn't put our all. We shouldn't put all of our eggs in one basket. Was her key points, and for, and also HE three is key to human survival since we have been destroying the Earth with fossil fuels all this time, and for us to change from that is very difficult. Also, um, Karen stated that the Earth. If the Earth colonizes, and if one colony only ends, then a new colony will continue to thrive. And she also specifically stated that um, HT3 is only on the moon, and it is, like Olivia said, key for survival. And space will also have sociological um, advantages for us humans on space. And like I said, um, if we continue staying on Earth, then there will be civil war, most likely. Since countries have been glaring at each other for millennia and millennia. And Jocelyn stated that, um, we, and since we polluted the earth, why can't we pollute the moon? Well, I can agree. Well, you said that we can. Well, well you said that um, if we live on the moon, then asteroids will destroy us completely. So, how can you have some a statement that says that we can pollute the moon if we can't even step foot in there, in your opinion. And, um, and when you said that AT3 doesn't belong to anyone, exactly, that's why whoever gets HE3 first will thrive the most. And um, since and HE3 is very important for human survival, since fossil fuels have been destroying our planet, which is the cause of global warming. So, so if we have HE3, Time. then...